<laughs> you can't help but laugh. Hey guys, I'm out of my parents' house doing some work. I'm about to start painting. guys I am home and I have pretty much just been laying in bed since I got home <laughs> haven't really been productive I think we're about to cook dinner but just wanted to I guess take a moment and share a little bit about what we've been going through um, I think we're we try to be really real on the vlog and I, I would say that we are usually but at the same time like there are certain emotions um, that we don't always share um, Anyways, we decided that we needed to get rid of Dell. Um, it was a really, really hard decision, and we are really, really struggling <laughs> with the fact that we did decide, you know, to get rid of him, but he was just really causing us a lot of stress, and we really in my opinion just made a mistake on getting him to begin with it was a decision I made pretty much or I begged Will for after the miscarriage and it was something that I thought would help me heal from that and I realized that it didn't um you know help me at all <laughs> And on top of that, I mean, we did love him. Um, we did have, you know, a relationship with him and wanted to be able to care for him. But he just didn't fit into our family, into our lives right now. And he was just causing me way too much stress. So, I just wanted to share that with y'all and let y'all know. Um, like I said, it was not easy. So, um, I'm very disappointed in myself, you know, that we had to do that. I'm... An animal lover I hate that we had to make that decision I mean it's just as simple as that so anyways just wanted to let y'all know um, so that it didn't get confusing one day when we just all of a sudden didn't have a kitten so I'm gonna try to get out of bed and make dinner and try to find a little bit of positive right now not that I know I've I, I don't know if I can. It's just, I mean, we've just been talking about how this has been a really hard year for us. There's just been a lot of stuff that's happened, and it's just, it's been tough. And I know that everyone goes through trials. Um, it's just hard when it's you going through it. And I just sometimes don't feel like I can pick myself back up, so... Anyways, just trying to be blunt a little bit. I think I'm going to get out of bed, and I think we're going to make some grilled chicken and mashed potatoes tonight. So, here goes nothing. And as if our day could not get any worse, Will is breaking out. Sorry, my hair just... Will is breaking out in poison ivy. He got it a little bit on his face, um, and then now it's breaking out like all over his arms and everything. So, that's great. Just fantastic. Um, hopefully he can get rid of it pretty quick. He's in the shower right now trying to just kind of wash off and I don't know if that helps. I know nothing about poison ivy. So if you have past experience with poison ivy, comment and let us know what works and how to get rid of it fast because I just can't, I just can't deal with this right now. So guys, as Macy has informed you, I do indeed have poison ivy or poison oak. I don't know. I, I handled both today with gloves, but I guess the gloves weren't good enough. I don't know, but here's what it looks like. It's like splotchy on my arm. And then I have some like up here on my face. It's cut, yeah, you can kind of see it. Oh yeah, you can see it right there. I normally have rosy cheeks anyway. Well, actually that looks pretty normal. That was pretty normal after getting out of the shower. But this, yeah, they're by your eye. that does not look normal for me. So 
fun stuff. Um, I don't even think I've, I think I've had it before, but maybe I haven't, but I've never really been susceptible to it. Like, but yes, I am. <laughs> so I'm gonna treat it and yeah, hope for the best. Dinner is served. We've got broccoli, mashed potatoes, chicken, guac, and chips. It looks delicious. And yes, I know my portion of starches to protein is not what it's supposed to be, but I don't care. I am looking forward to this delicious meal. <laughs> you can't help but laugh. I'm ah. so tired. We are exhausted. We just finished the Olympics and the girls won, spoiler alert. They won gold, it was super exciting. But we're tired. And Michael Phelps won two more gold medals. Oh yeah, well, I'm red right there. He's like a gold medal machine. A gold medal machine he is, yes. Anyways, we are heading to bed. And Macy really wants to watch Big Brother, but I told her I'll probably fall asleep It's not it. that I really want to, it's that we're way behind. Are we behind at all? Yeah, we know who wins HOH. <laughs> Excuse me. So we haven't watched up. Sundays. No. I don't know. <coughs> Gosh, I got the coughs. Yeah, we're just behind on TV because Olympics have kind of taken priority, which is fine. But because Olympics only come around once every four, four years. years. Every four years they come around. <laughs> okay. Anyways, we're headed to bed. So if you like this vlog, give it a big thumbs up. <laughs> subscribe to our channel if you haven't already leave us a friendly comment down below and we will see you guys tomorrow bye